Hi, I'm Barry Brents, Field Application Engineer in the Circuit Protection Division of TE Connectivity. And I wanted to talk a little bit about a frequent question that I get regarding our PolySwitch PTC devices. And that is, can I put PolySwitch devices in parallel to get a higher hold current? The answer is yes you can, and people do this. If you put two PolySwitch devices in parallel, I'm going to use a symbol like this, then you will get an increase in the hold current. The IMAX or maximum interrupt current rating of each device, um, well that will not be added. You cannot increase that because one device will trip, then the other one will trip, and the last one to trip will interrupt the full amount of current. So the interrupt current rating of the device will not be increased by having two in parallel. But the hold current, that is the amount of current that it can carry without tripping, will increase. In a perfect world where these two devices are thermally isolated from each other, you would get two times the whole current rating. But on most circuit boards, you can't do that. You don't have room for that. So if you put them close to each other and they share a little bit of heat, you might get 1.5, 1.8 times the whole current. So you may need to do some experimenting to determine uh, how much of an increase in whole current you're going to get. So um, in summary, Putting poly switch devices in parallel to increase whole current can be done, and it is done frequently. The increase will be two times or the current or some, something less, uh, depending on the thermal conditions on the board. Thank you.